Hello, so here I just want to explain how it is that you can add subtitles to a video presentation. Um, very useful if you have English language learners in your classroom. So if you are using PowerPoint, or if you've used PowerPoint to create your lectures or your notes to your students in the past, PowerPoint is a very nice feature wherein you can add subtitles in any language. Um, so underneath the slideshow button, you click on always use subtitles and then you select the language that you want to use. Um, so many of our students here in White Plains speak Spanish, so I went ahead and I selected the Spanish subtitle setting. Um, click on got it. And then as soon as you open up your PowerPoint or as soon as you start your presentation in PowerPoint, as you begin to speak, it will pick up your voice and translate what you've spoken and it's a pretty good translation of what it is that you're saying. Um, and that's what you're seeing here is happening. I will note that you can in fact use PowerPoint to record um, audio and then have it exported as a video file. Unfortunately, um, PowerPoint doesn't actually keep that, doesn't generate subtitles. So here I'll show you, you can underneath the slide, that same slideshow shedding record the PowerPoint um, but here, as you'll see, I'm within that record function under PowerPoint. And as I'm talking through, it doesn't actually change the setting. It doesn't change what I'm saying and it doesn't create those subtitles. So to be able to now capture the subtitles, you do need to have a live presentation running, have the subtitles enabled as I showed you previously. And now you need to use something else to do a screen recording of your PowerPoint presentation. And you can very easily use Zoom to do this. Let me show you how. So what you want to do is you open up Zoom and you select New Meeting. Um, by selecting New Meeting, that orange tab there in the top left corner, it'll open up a meeting where you are the only person in that room. And once you've started that meeting where it's just yourself, you can see in the bottom center of the screen that pops up in Zoom, you have these two really important functions. You have the ability to share your screen and you have the ability to record. So my suggestion is that you first share your screen and open up the PowerPoint presentation that you're talking over to create those subtitles for your presentation. And then you click on the record button. So here I've clicked on the share button first. And I will, from here, I will select the screen that I need to record. So in this case, I would select PowerPoint. And once I have selected PowerPoint, I would then click on the blue share button on your bottom right. And then following that, I would go back and hit the record button and then start speaking. And if you remember to enable your settings, you will have your subtitle settings underneath the slideshow tab, you will have and be recording a video that includes subtitles in the language that you need. And finally, when you've reached the end of your presentation, you just need to hit stop record, which will appear when you hover over your Zoom screen. And then once you cl um, close the meeting, Zoom will pop up with a screen that says converting file, and you'll have that file saved to your computer and that's a video file that you can easily upload into whichever platform it is that you're using.